Simon, the last time we had a Swedish player entering this stadium, he uh, went out with a blast. Yeah, it was Jon, right? Yeah. Yeah, he had a pretty good time here. You enter a, a long list of Swedish players at Feyenoord. Uh, did that influence your decision to come here? Maybe a little bit. Uh, not, not that much, I think. Uh, of course, it's, it's a positive that, that Swedish player had have had uh, great success here in, in Feyenoord and, and I hope it, it continues and I'm, I'm going to give 100% to, to try to do that. What are your expectations of your time at this club? Yeah, uh, I, have, I have high, high expectations. Uh, I think it's a great club and I think it's a, a great opportunity for me to be here. And, uh, and uh, Feyenoord has, has really good, like uh, they know me very well. And, and Jan has, has very good uh, contacts in Sweden and they have seen me play a lot of times. And, and they know what, what kind of player I am and what kind of person I am, so... What's the plan uh, Feyenoord is, is having with you? What have they told you? Are you a, a, a player that will be direct in, in, the, in the first uh, team or, or maybe for the future? What are their plans? Uh, of course, they, they, have, uh, they have bought me, so of course they have expectations on me and, and I, uh, I don't know what's, what the plan is. Uh, it's up to Gio, the coach. Of course, and uh, the only thing is I can ensure I will give 100%, 100% all the time and uh, try to do my best every day to, to develop and improve. Can you uh, tell us what kind of player you are, what, what position, what are your special qualities? Uh, you can say I'm a creative midfielder or attacking midfielder, what, what you call it. Uh, I think my strength is in the, in the passing game and... Uh, attacking pieces and, and try to score goals and assist and, and create chances. Uh, yeah. You already had to set some autographs after your first training, mm. but next Sunday that will be a, a different kind of story. Yeah, I heard it's a, it's a big day and a fantastic, uh, yeah, what can you say, fantastic day for, for all the players and for all the fans. Uh, it's a big thing, big thing here and I really look forward to it. Yeah. How do you feel about flying in a helicopter? Yeah, I trust the pilot, 100%, 100%. <laughs> no, I'm not afraid of, of flying or heights or something like that? No, not really. Great. Uh, um, last thing, you, uh, uh, you're still a, a, a very young player, uh, but already had a big success uh, a small month ago with the European Championship. How was that? Yeah, that was amazing. Uh, it was really like an adventure. Uh, it was almost unreal. We went there with uh, with high expectations within the group, but but no one believed in us, and and uh, yeah, somehow we made it all the way and and uh, managed to win the whole championship. It was a group where John Guidetti also was a, was a part of. Did, did you talk to him about this this uh, about your new club? Yeah, I talked uh, talked to him about it, and uh, he has only good memories and good things to say about about the city and about the club and everything. He praised everything.